so we will discuss today about balance of a particle in electric field and potential due to dipole now equilibrium of a charged particle in electric field suppose हमारे पास कोई electric field है and in that electric field there is a charged particle like an oil drop having excess electron or lack of electron this is uniform electric field two plates one is positively charged and another is negatively charged so direction of electric field will be positive to negative it is the uniform electric field e and here is a drop let mass of drop is m so weight will act vertically downward and and it has excess electron so it is negatively charged so force will act opposite to the electric field if both the forces are equal then it is weight and it is electric force then it will be in equilibrium in stable position in stationary position q equal mg for a drop for a spherical charged particle if it is spherical then mass is equal to volume into density and if number of electron excess or lack is n of radius r density rho and number of electron excess or lack n then q equals n and m equals volume into density if it is spherical so 4 by 3 pi r q into rho so we can say that n e e p 4 by 3 pi r q rho into d by using this formula we can find the radius of the charged particle or the oil drop whatever is if it is spherical and either radius is given then we can find the density if both are given and electric field also we can find the number of electron excess or less so this is very important question for the numerical purpose <coughs> our next topic is potential due to dipole dipole first is axial position suppose a dipole ab made by minus q plus q charges mid point is o and length of dipole is 2 we have to find potential at point c at a distance r from mid point then distance of c from b r minus c distance of a from c r plus a so potential potential due to plus q suppose it is given k q upon r r means r minus a and potential due to minus q suppose it is due to this minus k q upon 
R plus A. So net potential, V will add what? V1 plus V2. And it is A2 is common. Remaining is 1 upon R minus A minus 1 upon R plus A. 1 upon this minus 1 upon this. V equals KQ. R plus A, R minus A upon R minus A into R plus A, R square minus A square. R is cancelled, so it is 2A, 2A into Q is equal to P, so V is equal to K, P upon R square minus A square. As we know that R is very much greater than A, so A approx negligible then potential at c will be v equals kp upon r square k p upon r square where k is 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught this is the potential again dipole ab midpoint row we have to determine potential at c so distance of c from v r minus a distance of c from a r plus a we will write potential at C due to this point charge and this point charge and net can be found by adding both of them. By solving this, we get this and as R is very much less than that of R. So for like this, this is the potential due to dipole in axial position. Now again, in equatorial position, second is equatorial. equatorial position again now point is in equatorial position how like this a b is a dipole of length to a midpoint is o and made by minus q plus q charge we have to determine electric potential at point c at a distance r from midpoint o on bisector of a b we have to determine potential at bisector of AB. Join A with C, B with C, and now this is R square plus A square and its root according to Pythagoras theorem. So, from here, AC is equal to BC. AC is equal to BC is equal to root R square plus A square. So potential at C due to plus Q. Due to plus Q, KQ upon R. R means root R square plus A square. And due to minus Q, KQ upon again R square plus A square. R square plus A square. So V is equal to V1 plus V2. When we will add the both as both are equal in magnitude and sign is opposite, so it will be zero. Thus we can say in equatorial position it is zero. So at every point of OC means not only there, here also. So thus potential is zero, potential is same. So it become a equipotential surface. So in equatorial position potential is zero. In next video we will discuss about equipotential surface and potential energy of system of charges.